Hey everyone, I'm Megan O'Levy and this is your UFC Minute. The UFC returns this weekend with a fresh face who is destined to make headlines. When UFC President Dana White went looking for a fight, he was hoping that he would end up with a future UFC star. And those are the expectations after he signed a regional champion who has dominated the local women's bantamweight circuit en route to her octagon debut this weekend. That's it for today. Stay tuned for your next UFC Minute, and I'll see you at the fights. All right, coming up next, it's a UFC Women's Bantamweight Division matchup. Well, she was discovered on Dana White looking for a fight, and man, does she deserve to be in the big show after that type of performance. Here she is, a little wide-eyed as she makes the walk here tonight. Perhaps the UFC jitters will be a factor. This is a decidedly different experience than competing in a regional promotion. Of course, Dana White was watching that night. He's in the building tonight. We'll see how it goes for her in the UFC debut. This girl is an outstanding striker. She definitely wants to keep this fight on the feet. She has very good takedown defense as well. Good hands, very good kicks, elbows, knees, and punches. A full arsenal of striking techniques.
while she is a really accomplished submission specialist, and candidly, Joe, not a lot of women are used to facing opponents on this level. She's got to be thinking tonight, how quickly can I get this fight to the ground and set up my high-level submission game? A lot of different chokes in her arsenal. She attacks from a lot of different angles. Very strong lower body, particularly her hips. Very excited to see what she can do tonight if this fight hits the mat. This girl has some of the best Brazilian jiu-jitsu in the division. Her submissions are outstanding, and she has a full arsenal of them. That is what she's gonna wanna try to do in this fight, bring the fight down to the ground, and utilize those beautiful Brazilian jiu-jitsu skills. And here is tonight's tale of the tape. Two years apart, these two fighters, with similar height and some differences in reach. All right, now for the particulars, here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC Bantamweight division. Introducing first, fighting at the blue corner, making her UFC debut here tonight. She stands five feet nine inches tall, weighing in at 135 pounds. Fighting out of Las Vegas, Nevada, St. Pete. And now introducing her opponent, fighting out of the red corner, a jiu-jitsu fighter, holding a professional record of 12 wins, one loss. She stands 5 feet 8 inches tall, weighing in at 134 pounds, fighting out of Calgary, Alberta, Canada, Cyclops. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Eve Lavin. The veteran Eve Levine draws the assignment here. While so much mixed martial arts history has been made within these very walls, we're always thrilled to come back. Great to have you with us as we broadcast live from Saitama Super Arena here in Japan. All right, so here she is as we get ready to go for round one, the much-hyped UFC debut for this young woman. She won her last fight, many of you saw it, in front of Dana White and Matt Serra on looking for a fight. Now we'll see if her game translates to the big show. No easy outs in this division. We'll see if she can get off. Whoa! Wow! This could be it! Big right hand there. Trying to stay in this fight! And there comes the separation now. Boom! Shin to the dome. That was a very quick combination. Oh, big left hook there! Good combinations landing here. Nice. Starts to get the combination going with the fist. Oh! Nice. This could be it right here. Big oh. shot to the head. She's hurt. She is stunned. Whoa. with the ground and pound. Unbelievable. That is it. Nasty ground and pound for the win. Yeah, Joe, she might have the best ground and pound game in this entire division. It was certainly on full display here tonight. And it's one thing when you're trying to score on the ground and bide some time a little bit. She was trying to finish this result, literally trying to knock her opponent's head through the canvas. And ultimately, she gets the desired result here tonight, and maybe a $50,000 performance bonus will follow. And here we see it one more time. Look at the timing in this shot. Bam! And good night. And there she is after the massive knockout. That is one they will be talking about for quite some time. All right, we now go inside the octagon. Bruce Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Levine is going to stop to this contest at two minutes, 45 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout, St. So a nice way to win the UFC debut and the UFC jitters, famed as they may be, not a factor for her here tonight as she starts to celebrate with her coaches. Congratulations to the UFC newcomer on the big W in her UFC debut.